Hello YouTube, hi, my name is Mark and this is Nixon Motorsports. This channel is all about motorsports from racing to exotic cars and even simulators. Today's video, we're here at Eagles Canyon Raceway. We have a couple days of testing, uh, getting ready for the race weekend, the double header next week. I just thought I'd bring you along, show you what we're doing, made some chassis setup changes. So it's a little bit of a tuning um, exercise here for the next couple days. Clouds are out today, as you can see. Rain, I think, is a negative. I think today will be a good day. Anyway, with that, let's get into the video. Come on. So we have the race car ready. I got a gear up here in a minute. Uh, we got all of our original telemetry working. A fair amount of changes on the car. Um, say hi, Jeff. Jeff's out here. Hi, Jeff. Um, so if you saw the previous video where I um, did a lot of setup or motor swap and, and kind of a maintenance activity. New motor in it, new differential. Um, and then on the pads, we stiffened the rear a bit. We lowered the rear, uh, trying to move the center of gravity to the back of the car a touch. We want to see what that does. So that's a little bit of, a little bit of this experimentation today. So this first session out, it, it's simply a more of an installation lap with a new motor. Um, We'll run a few laps, make sure we don't have fluids flying everywhere, right. that basic right. kind of stuff. And um, and then we'll get on with the program the rest of the day. I don't know. What, any thoughts? Yeah. No? Just make sure the car is working right and then uh, see how we can go faster. So this is Jeff in the morning. He's had a little bit of wake up time and a little bit, well, actually non-coffee, but sort of coffee. <laughs> <laughs> All right. No, he's awake. There's a smile. <laughs> No. That was a negative. Or the dance, like a uh, running man. Yep. You know the running man. Jeff. Better not do. Okay, so we went out session one. Initially, a little drama. You know, the uh, tire, um, these tire sensors that I was talking about that we put on this first set of rims did not work. They're actually uh, flopping all over the place. So we had to come in quickly. Um, obviously, it's a balance issue. So we threw back um, another set of wheels, went out and ran three laps. The car balance feels okay. Um, it, it did have a medium speed or medium high speed understeer. So we, um, we quickly got it back on the scales. We've um, made a couple changes, raised the ride height, this one example. And uh, we're gonna go out here in a few minutes and see what it does. So let's get into it.
All right, so this is Saturday. There's Jeff. And um, we were to go on track today and test again today. But instead, we're going to have, as Jane says, a fun day. <laughs> A motor fun day. A motor, a motor pulling party. Yeah, right. So um, we're gonna pull the motor that we have in the car. So we just put this in, um, as you saw, if you saw the video just a couple days ago, um, very few miles on the motor. We're having an issue with the motor. We saw, we we saw speeds drop, and we saw. We saw things that made us look at it closer, let's put it that way. We don't know what's wrong with it, but um, we're gonna have to pull the motor. So um, that's what we're doing today. We're gonna yank this motor, get it out, um, and uh, reinstall our previous motor that has that has uh, time left on it. It's, so we're gonna do yeah, that. It's yeah. got time. Yeah, yeah. You know, and so <clears throat> I, guess, <laughs> I guess the thing to say is, uh, these type of cars require a fair amount of effort and energy. You know, this is not the kind of thing you like to do, um, but it does happen and it requires, you know, uh, let's see, what, what are the words that come to mind? It requires a certain amount of stamina, a certain amount of... Uh, Labor. <laughs> <laughs> effort, time, money, all those things, right? So um, you just need to you need to think of that, you know, if you're gonna race anything and race it hard and push limits, you know, stuff's gonna happen. Um, whether it be a, a open wheel race car like this or a sports car or whatever not, but anyway, so um, today we're back into the motor swapping, getting greasy, that type of thing. And um, not a big deal, but that's what we got going on today. Yep. You, anything else? Let's get after it. Basically, that's Jeff saying, yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> All right.
All right, so I hope you enjoyed that motor swap <laughs> um, in, in fast video, right? So you can see everything that's involved in doing that. But uh, really quickly, the, the motor itself, so it's unfortunate we had to pull it, um, but we had a week before our race weekend coming up, so we had to do that. Um, but here's what happened. We started out with installation laps, then we got into our tuning aspects of the of the car, right? Modifying setup and changes for performance. And all seem all seemed to be okay. We did see uh, some lap time drop. We saw some top speeds start to fall. Initially, we, uh, uh, we, we thought that that was just some of the changes that we were making on, on the race car. Um, but after looking into it closer, we did find um, a problem and then um, uh, even a, a deeper look, we found that no, no, there's, there's clearly a motor problem. So that's why the motor's being pulled. Apparently uh, something in the build process, um, according to the motor builder, and he seemed to think he knew what it was. But anyway, the motor's out, it's heading back to him and we're fine. So we're running our previous motor, the 22 motor, it has enough life on it, it will be fine. Uh, so we'll run that until we do uh, the next swap out. But um, that's what the last couple of days of testing was all about. <laughs> but that's it for this video. Um, two days of testing turned into one day of testing, one day of motor swap. You know, it is what it is, right? Um, we are ready though for this next race weekend. Uh, U.S. Majors race. I think you'll enjoy that. It should be a good one. Looking at the weather forecast out over the next 10 days looks a little questionable, so we'll see what happens. But um, watch, watch for that video. I think you'll enjoy that. Um, you know, if you haven't subscribed, you know, do so, and that will keep you informed. Um, but I think you'll enjoy that. Um, and following the upcoming U.S. Majors here next week. Um, after that, we'll, we will be prepping for the June sprints, um, which should be a fantastic race. So we're looking forward to that. And that, that's at Road America, by the way. So anyway, that's it for this video. Thank you. I appreciate you watching, supporting this channel. The comments, they're fantastic. Keep them coming. Until next time. Ciao.